Well, I think uh, in camp, obviously in Andorra, if you pass and if you want to ride uh, one of the, the famous mountains, in a, uh, uh, one of the very famous mountains we have here, you have to pass in camp because uh, Cortals by Chalice uh, or Porta and Valira, uh, every one of them, uh, yeah, you, you have to go through in camp, obviously. Um, so I think, um, yeah, in camp is, uh, is, uh, is one of the biggest towns, obviously, in Andorra. And uh, now with the, with the new event here, the new Gran Fondo, mm -hmm. uh, it's, uh, it's one of the, 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 the towns people will remember if they talk about cycling in Andorra. Yeah, we had a nice, nice chat with Jack actually to catch up. It was a nice event, a lot of uh, enthusiastic people came out. Um, and uh, yeah, I think it also makes, makes our rides much more fun if, uh, if you can ride with such a, such a big group of people. And uh, yeah, I must say, obviously we knew the roads already before, so uh, we knew what to expect. But uh, for us to uh, to train like this during the season, it's always a nice uh, a nice way to uh, to do our work.